I'm Courtney Murphy, Denver Metro Realtor. Today we are here in Brighton, Colorado, in the Brighton Crossing neighborhood. And right now we're looking at homes by Brookfield Residential, and specifically we're looking at their freestyle collection. Really cute collection of homes. The salesperson um, described it to me as contemporary farmhouse. So, so have that in mind when we're looking at the home. I think you'll see what they, she means. Okay, first, when we first walk in, we do have just kind of this little for your area just a nice spot to get settled when you come in and says welcome to your home but when we turn around you're really into your open living main living space and look at all the windows there are just windows everywhere and not only are there the lower windows but they have some upper windows as well and this room is completely vaulted so it just feels fresh and airy in here all the, the vault and the light, and it's a good size too. So really like this living space, I gotta say. Let's head over here real quick, because I do want to show you. We have a couple double doors right here leading out onto the front porch there. And again, the break room, which you just kind of checked out. Pretty much this whole living area is nice undefined space, gives you some flexibility for sure when setting up your furniture. Now in between our great room and our kitchen, you can see we have our dining space. Uh, probably a little bit longer than average table they have in here, but you have plenty of space if you need to put in a longer table. Maybe you have a big family, right? And then turn it around, we're into our kitchen here. Nice kitchen island. They have three chairs pulled up. Maybe you could do four, but three fits comfortably. Uh, we have our sink and our island here, so that's nice. If you're doing dishes, you can still be uh, socializing with the family or have your eye on the Bronco game there. Um, a good amount of cabinets and countertop space in this kitchen. Just really adorable, I have to say. Turn it around, we, I do have to show you. These are our sliders um, leading out onto our patty pair over here. And see that door over there? Can you see that cameraman in, in through the windows, that door? That's coming in from your garage. So your garage is not actually leading right into the house. You do step out into the patio here. Um, and you cut, you could come right in these sliders right over here. We have this nice room set up in here. They have it set up as like a little sitting room, but it would definitely make a good office space. Okay, keeping on walking. We have a nice pantry area right in here. They put in a little built-in desk here. That's pretty nice. We have our powder bath for the main floor right over here. And then we're into our mudroom area and combo laundry room. Because this right here is our, garage, our door in from our garage. They put some benches in here. Nice functional mudroom laundry room combination. All right. Let's see if I cover everything. Oh, I, you know, I guess the only thing I didn't cover, we have our stairs leading upstairs here and our stairs leading into our basement over there. We're going to go ahead head upstairs and check that out right Okay, here. here we are at the top of the stairs. I uh, want to point out, when you get to the top, we could take a right right here. We have a couple steps up. That's leading to our master bedroom. We'll go check that out in just a minute. And we have our secondary bedrooms over this way. Got a nice linen closet right here. But let's go ahead and check out these secondary bedrooms. Come into the first, this first one. Very, it's decorated, so cute, I gotta say that. Some windows right here, and then this does have its own walk-in closet over there. All right, coming right this way, we come into a bathroom, we have a sink right here. And then you have a door right here, this is leading into a private bath and toilet area. And then we're leading right into another vanity because this is a shared bathroom with our next secondary bedroom. But cute setup, I like the way they have that designed. Um, walking this way, this would be the closet for this next secondary bedroom. And here we are in the secondary bedroom. Some good windows in here. Um, I kind of like how they're, they're set up because it's unique. We have a couple tall windows right over here. And then cameraman, if you walk out this way and then get a shot over here. These are facing the front of the house. I like the big long one and then the shorter one. Um, the ceiling's just, the room feels interesting, gotta say. All right, walking back out this way. We just made a little circle. We're back out towards the stairs. Now we're gonna check out the master bedroom. Up the couple stairs here into the master. Really like it. 
Uh, feels nice and cheery in here. We've got three great big windows across the back, um, looking up the back of your home right over there. It just has a good, nice, open feel. You can see over here, there's kind of a nook. They set up a desk here, maybe a good spot for a chair. Um, but that's a nice master bedroom. Let's check out the master bath. Uh, first, right uh, to our left here when we walk in, we have a nice size master closet. We have our toilet closet right here. And then walking back this way, straight back at the end, we have a nice large shower with a nice big seat in there and our double sink vanity right here. Again, my name is Courtney Murphy, Denver Metro Realtor. We're here in Brighton, Colorado, in the Brighton Crossings neighborhood. And we're looking at homes by Brookfield Residential. If you'd be interested in seeing one of these contemporary farmhouse homes, definitely give me a ring. I'd love to help you find the right home for you and your family, and I'll save you a little bit of money with my closing cost credit. So give me a call. Let's talk about it. And be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel where I'm uploading new home tours around the Denver area every single week. Thanks for joining me today and have a wonderful day.